So Nakhon Ratchasima city also known as Korat is the third biggest city of Thailand. So being the third biggest city of Thailand there are many places to visit in the Korat city as well as there are places that can be visited near the Korat city as well. So I have already made a video where I showed you the top 5 places to visit in the Korat city but today I am making a video about places that can be visited near the Korat city. So this video is going to be informative for those guys who are already in Korat and don't know which places they should go and visit and this video will also be helpful for those guys who are planning to come to Korat. So without any delay let's get started with today's video and let's check out some of the must visit places near the Korat city. So the fifth spot goes to the airplane park in Korat. So this place is around 16 kilometers from the Korat city center and over here you will find a Boeing 747 and you will also find a big cafe known as the takeoff cafe. Here is a real Boeing 747. So yes, it's good to be over here at this cafe. So you can get drinks or food at the cafe which is reasonable. Most of the drinks are like 60 baht only and if you want to go up inside the plane you have to pay 50 baht so which is like around 1.5 USD. So, so you can get a boarding pass over here from the airline staff. So the airline is RM airline and now I can go and board the plane over here. Mm. This is a real plane, so they have the seats just like a real plane. We can easily stretch our legs, and the view is good. How's the boarding from Hamburg? So, the second floor of the plane is closed for the public. But yes, it's good to come over here and look at plane, give it some time. Definitely a good place for locals who haven't been on uh, a plane. But yes, it was fun to be here. It was good to explore this old Boeing 747. So this is a good place to visit near Korat. It's only around 16 kilometers from the city center and it's vaulted. And the fourth spot goes to the Fimai National Park. So Fimai National Park is located around 60 kilometers from the Korat city center and the entry ticket for the Fimai National Park is 100 Thai baht for a foreigner. So the design of the Fimaya temple resembles to some extent to the design of the Angkor Wat temple which is the biggest religious monument in the world and Fimaya is the biggest Khmer Hindu temple over here in Thailand. So if you are in Korat, Fimaya is a good place to visit. So not just for like, um, like from the temple point of view uh, but because it's an important part of the history of Isan. So you can reach Fimai via a bus or you can book a tour from a tour company. So when I was there, I saw people coming into a tour company, uh, but it's up, just up to people. So you can visit over here to a rental car or a rental bike as well. The temple is a good place for anybody who is interested in the history of Thailand. And you can also visit Fimai National Museum for whose entry is free.
So at the third spot we have Khaoyai Thiang which is located around 50 kilometers from the Nakhon Ratchasima city center and it's located in the CQ district of Nakhon Ratchasima province. So Khaoyai Thiang is famous among the Thai locals for its beautiful views. People can go to the dam nearby, people can uh, ride bike on a trek at Khaoyai Thiang windmill. Uh, so yes, it's a beautiful spot. Many locals go over here and the good thing is that there are many resorts over here and there are many camping places in Khao Yai Thiang. So many people who go to Khao Yai Thiang do go over there for camping because the camping over here is cheap. At some places you can find camping a spot for as cheap as 250 baht. So Yes, uh, Khao Yai Thing is famous for its beauty and also for its camping. So I've seen song tours going to Khao Yai Thiang, but you can also come over here on a rented taxi or you can hire a car and see, enjoy the views of Khao Yai Thiang and also do camping at Khao Yai Thiang. Now at number 2 we have Wat Ban Rai Temple or also known as Elephant Temple in Thailand. So this is one of the most famous temple not just near Korat but also in Isan region. So many people from all over Thailand do come to visit this temple not just because of the beauty of this temple but also because of the monk associated with this temple. So the monk who built this temple his name was Lumpa Khon uh, some people pronounce it like uh, uh, Lumpa Khon like uncle father like that so anyway I won't go into name too much but yes he was way too famous and he did a lot of charitable work uh, talking about this temple this temple represent heaven and hell so they have murals depicting the deeds if people do good deeds they go to heaven and if people do bad deeds they go to hell so they have depiction of heaven and hell over here and they also have a small library over here at the temple so overall the temple is like uh, like an island it's located on a small pond it's way too beautiful and the good thing is that it's only 60 kilometers from uh, 60 kilometers from Korat city and you can easily reach over here on a uh, rented taxi or you can rent a car to visit over here as well overall this place is not too far from Korat and it's one of the most famous temple of Korat and you know what's the good thing this temple is located in my own town so I'm from Dankuntot in Korat and this temple is in the Duncan Tote town. Also you can feed some elephants over here as well which is always a good thing to do. So the final spot goes to the Korat Jew which is located around 16 kilometers from the Korat city center. So over here you can find a lot of animals which is a normal thing because it's a zoo but there is also a water park where you can relax and enjoy with your family and the entry tickets for the foreigners over here is 350 baht and for locals it's 130 baht so Korat Zoo is a good place to visit near Korat city and that's why it ranks number one in our list So I will end this video over here but I hope that you found this video informative. You got to see some places that can be visited. Uh, the places that are near Korat city. So I, I will end this video over here but I will see you in the next video. Have a great day ahead. I will see you in the next video. Till then. Peace.